looks like a lot going on, so I want to kind of brighten it up. I hate to have to start over again. Nobody's going to see the inside of this but me. I want to change this ceiling out because this is just the tapestry. And it just looks like a lot going on. So I want to kind of brighten it up, lighten it up. So I have these. And these are just some um, foam boards with the, uh, that looks like wood paneling. And it's actually just foam boards. They're very flexible. So what I was thinking is that since I have these metal strips still here, have these metal strips that go all the way across and that's what these are on. Ugh. They're just on with magnets that I hook to these metal strips. <laughs> so I'm thinking that I can do the same here or maybe this heavy duty, I don't know if it's backwards on there, high strength 90 spray adhesive by 3M. It's probably backwards on the camera, I don't know. But that's what I'm thinking of trying because it's such a tiny space and my bed is so big and the dark ceiling makes it look smaller. So I'm thinking I wanna try this. So let's do this. <laughs> let's see, where can I put you? Take off these magnets down that I have up here. It means the lights have to come down too. And this is on with magnets also, if you didn't know. Just on with magnets. <laughs> Let's take that down. So everything is exposed again. So let me see how I'm gonna actually set this up. And you're crooked. <laughs> it's a little crooked. Disappeared. All right, so should I? This way? I think I want to go closer to the edge. Okay. I'm 
thought I was going to go with spray. It's spraying on a magnet. <laughs> okay, so first magnet. Okay, the glue is sticking just fine. So maybe I won't worry about the magnet. Although I do have it. Okay, I should have covered up some things. Alright. Okay, I'm not going to worry about that magnet or even trying to get up. However, the adherence of the glue. do this and cover all the magnetic pieces up with this how am I gonna put my lights back up because my lights are magnetic because so I can put the lights to on the side that will help cover up some more of this stuff ah, we'll see we'll see oh gosh all right Keep going as far as I can go and see what happens. Okay, let's go ahead and spray this one. Being careful not to get it on anything else. some up top too okay I have started and this is how it's turning out and I, I do after I put it up there I did notice some gaps but what's concerning me are these spots I don't know if it, the glue is melting the foam like, because that's not how it was when I got it so I think the glue is melting the foam because the foam itself comes like this. And there are no pock marks or whatever those are. I think the glue is too strong and it's like melting the foam. Oh, oh hum. Don't know what to do now. I'm not sure what to do about that. Or if I'm gonna have to start over again. I hate to have to start over again. So, one of the magnets that was attached to this fan fell off, so I, I used some spray glue that I was using to spray those, adhere those, and I'm just uh, trying to keep it up there until it dries. But so far it looks okay, except for those pock marks. Those little marks where I guess the glue is too strong. So I need to another pack so I can get the edges of these. 
and I still need to do the front section too, so I'm gonna need one more pack to finish. So I'll be calling on Amazon. <laughs> But it doesn't look terrible. You know, sometimes wood has imperfections, so I'm not gonna stress too much about it. And there's some that's overlapped and, and this edge here where I cut off just a little too much. So I'll worry about that later. But yeah, it's not, not terrible, not great. Considering that nobody is going to see the inside of this but me, I guess it will suffice. But yeah, it is what it is. I'll get another pack and I will let you know how it turns out. Another project. I'm getting rid of that. I'm getting rid of all of that. I'm going to downsize, put everything in this cart so I'll have all this space open, hopefully. That's just my, my glue and what I'm working on, the magnets. But I'm getting rid of this shelf altogether, I think. I'm going to see how that goes. All right. This bed is comfortable. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. This is a finished result from me redoing my ceiling with the styrofoam planks that I purchased off of Amazon. And I think the brand was called A La Mason. So it did turn out okay. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, to comment, and subscribe. I'm on a quest for a thousand subscribers. Catch you on the next video.